St. Patrick's Day and plenty of events are going around on our area, no doubt about it. In fact, one celebration is just getting started underway in Canton at Looney's Pub. Our photojournalist this morning, Eric Nielsen, is out there. He's been out there this morning. All right, we're looking at Looney's Pub right now, Eric. Can you sort of set the scene, describe what you're seeing? Well, Megan, we're outside Looney's Pub. The food has just gotten delivered. Uh, we're going to have some fresh stuff here. They're going to be cooking it all day. People are starting to show up. The doors have just opened. It, uh, it's really exciting. Uh, everyone's dressed up in the festivities. All right. Lots of food, lots of drinks. So 6 a.m., they're doing this um, beer and bacon thing, which I guess is a tradition. Have you had a chance to see the food or smell it? And what do you think? You're a food guy. I haven't seen it, but I can smell it. It smells fantastic. <laughs> the bacon, the beer, I, I'm very jealous that everyone gets to have all these beers right now, and I, <laughs> and I have to work. But uh, it, it's going to be a lot of fun out here in Canton Square all day. It's going to be a great time. Canton Square is sort of a, um, a popular place for St. Patrick's Day. Are the, are the streets blocked off there? I know that it's so early in the morning, there's probably not a lot going on besides what we're seeing right now outside of Looney's. But you've been out there all morning. Uh, you know, are there areas that are blocked off? Well, they've got some metal gates out here. They are going to block off the streets. In fact, they're, they've been telling me that I've got, to, I've got to move my truck here in a little bit because these streets will be blocked off so people can have a good time throughout the square, just walk around. Uh, I, I do not advise you coming down here to drive, but uh, coming down here to party and to drink, it's going to be a great time all day. All right. Well, it looks like it's, uh, it's just getting started this early in the morning, 6 o'clock. I know they said they were opening their doors. See if you can go in there and talk them into giving you some bacon. We know you can't have some beer, but get some bacon, and then uh, we'll check in with you in a little bit. You can tell us how it is. How's that? Okay. Sounds great. All right. Eric Nielsen reporting live this morning in Canton. We'll check in with him in just a bit down at Looney's Pub. And he mentioned drinking on St. Patrick's Day. A lot of you do it. If you do do it, don't get behind the wheel. You don't have to because Tipsy Taxi with Yellow Cab and the Baltimore City, they're offering free rides this weekend to would-be drunk drivers. The number right there is on your screen. That's the number to call. It's one 963 8294. Rides begin free tomorrow at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. That lasts until 4 a.m. on Sunday. If you're headed home from a Baltimore City bar or restaurant and going straight home, the ride is free unless it's more than 50 bucks. Then you have to pay the difference. Something to keep in mind, write down that number if you are going out. And in case you didn't get a chance to write that number down, we do have it posted on our website alongside all St. Patrick's Day stuff, including some recipes. Head to our website. It's abc2news.com. You can find all this information featured under the Stories section, which is on the left-hand side of our homepage.